So with Donald Trump, uh, there are two things. There are uh, vicious juvenile attacks and there's projection. And sometimes there's both, and so we have an example of that today. Uh, Nancy Pelosi had done a press conference about impeachment and uh, a bit of the video had been tweeted about by a Republican uh, congressman. And uh, Trump decided to quote retweet that section about Nancy Pelosi saying, because Nancy's teeth were falling out of her mouth and she didn't have time to think. So he is implying that in this bit of video, her teeth were falling out of her mouth. If that's not what he's implying, then I have no idea. It's difficult sometimes to interpret this level of mania, but that's what he said. The issue is that the video doesn't show that. The video shows that just before answering a reporter's question, Pelosi moved her mouth slightly and took a sip of water, but her teeth did not appear out of place and her speech was not interrupted. And even if they did, like this is even not something that the did. President of the United States should be joking about or talking about. Like this is so juvenile. That is a first first grader joke. Like, yeah. oh, your teeth fell out. Ha ha ha. That's not like that is not an adult thing. That is not a presidential thing. And I get so tired of like the whole like doing like the both sidesy like um like do you remember when Michelle Wolf made a joke about Sarah Huggabee Sanders? Essentially, the oh, joke remember. was that she tries to fancy it up a little too much for the podium. Essentially, like that was kind of like the joke, like smoky eyeshadow and lies. And it became yes. this: How dare you talk about her looks? You called this woman ugly, which is not what happened. But like, I agree. People on the right were like, "Do not mention a woman's makeup. Do not mention her appearance. Don't." And yes. I can rock with that. You, I also think this should be. Upsetting, then, right? Yeah. If, like, if by principle, if that's if that you know what I mean, like yeah. if that's where you stand. But again, I, like I said, I hate to do that. And I just did it in detail. No, I like it because I find but that very. It, it allows me to say, by the way, Michelle Wolf has a new special joke show on Netflix, and it's hilarious. <laughs> um, but this yeah. is so frustrating, and I don't know. It's like. So it's also Monday. It's Monday, and tomorrow it's, it's going to be Tuesday. I know, I know. That it's going to be Wednesday. Well, and Tuesday we're not going to remember it because he's going to say something else crazy exactly. like this. Well, and that's the thing. Like, so I get that. Some people will say, come on, John, come on, damage report. Why are you wasting our time with this? And I get it. There's a lot of other important stuff. I would argue that we're covering some of it on the show today. But like, what are you supposed to do? What are you supposed to do? Are with you supposed that? to just yeah. say, oh, this doesn't look like anything to me. I have no standards anymore, so I'm going to allow everything. <laughs> and I understand that like covering it doesn't stop it, no, obviously. I mean, it's it's but like, what are you supposed to do if you want to live in a rational world? Yeah. What course can we take at this point? I don't know. It is so. It, this is mortifying. Like just a couple weeks ago, like a group of normal leaders were one. But I guess actually a couple of them are. Pretty have made pretty horrible mistakes, but we're like mm -hmm. making fun of how. Yes. <laughs> I said one, and then I realized Mo who else was standing there, and I was like, okay, all. so actually all of them in the all circle. of them are bad too, <laughs> in different ways. <laughs> right. But we're making fun of how ridiculous this man is, and he's just mm -hmm. just going with it. He's just doubling down on, I am a fool. Mm -hmm. Like I, I mean, yeah. Um, so. I, I like at the, at the I have no, I have to say it. Okay, I had to say it because we pulled the videos anyway. So I have to say it. Hmm. Um, it's not just that he's like saying her teeth were falling out when they were. It's this weird like Michael Scottian thing where mm -hmm. like he looks at something <laughs> and he describes it in a way that's objectively not like you're talking about people laughing. They're not laughing. You're talking about teeth falling out. They're not. They're not falling out. How which seems dare you what? compare the goat? That is <laughs> no, but like Michael that's, Scott. But to I've only this man. I've only compared him to the worst <laughs> components. He does that thing, and he might have done Scott's tots. It's Trump's tots. <laughs> that's how. Anyway, but the important thing is it didn't happen. And I, I alluded to in the intro that it's projection. Like he he did that projection about Elizabeth Warren. Like in her marriage, when he's clearly talking about the fact that Melania lives on a different floor than he does. <laughs> and this is just the most specific projection I've ever seen. Because when he's talking about somebody having trouble talking because their teeth are falling out, I understand that if you're an elderly person, you have to deal with dentures. I don't yet know what that's like, but I am aging and I eat a lot of sugar. So I'll get there. But for right now, Trump's there, as you'll see. Let us rethink old assumptions and open our hearts and minds to possible and possibilities. And finally, I ask the leaders of the region, political and religious, Israeli and Palestinian, Jewish and Christian and Muslim, to join us in the noble quest of 
for lasting peace. Thank you. God bless you. God bless Israel. God bless the Palestinians. And God bless the United States. Thank you very much. Did, was that an audio thing? By the way, thank you for saying God bless the Palestinians. Yeah, that was I'm nice. shocked we he said that. I hadn't seen that. Good job. The rest of the performance was terrible. Your teeth have fallen out. Uh, and by the way, because well, you're, you're an older say that man, it's a weird thing to say to exactly. anybody. No, I'm. I'm. I, I understand. Yeah. It's not an actual loophole. Yes. But as a kid, the loophole was when you do it, I get to do no, it to you. So no, but he's an older guy. He's got dentures. Sometimes they slip out. That's just a thing that happens. I have no idea if Nancy Pelosi even has dentures, but if she does, they might slip out. That's just a thing that happens. But if yours perpetually are slipping out and you're slurring in your speeches, maybe be a little bit more accommodating if someone else doesn't even have that happen. Yeah, I just, yeah. With what? your ridiculous projection. It's just frustrating. Like, I would, it would just be so much more respectful. Bring up something in her district that your base wouldn't like. Yeah. Bring up something, you know what I mean? Like, instead, it's like but, she's coming after you. With the threat of impeachment, mm -hmm. and you're talking about her teeth as yeah. like a comeback because that's all it takes. And yeah. this is just juvenile, and I, it, I hate the whole. You know, you know, I, it's just I don't know the office of the presidency. Not even that. Just being an adult mm -hmm. <laughs> should be the factor that like you don't behave like that, you don't yeah. act like that, you don't say things like that. Um, yeah, and as as a person who wants someone who's different in fundamental ways to occupy the office. I hate that that gets conflated with, well, Trump is different. Yeah. yeah, but not in the good ways, okay? I want someone who who doesn't accept donations from certain types of industries, who actually rethinks what's possible, what we can do with legislation, all of that. I want someone who fundamentally rethinks what the presidency is about, but not in a way that just results in trolling people. That's e a waste. Everything that he tweets or says publicly is like, um, it, it's a representation of our country, and mm -hmm. it's, I'm embarrassed. Yeah. Thank you for watching this clip from The Damage Report. For more content from the show and access to TYT Network members only exclusives, go to tyt.com slash Brooke. Wait, no, it's tyt.com slash John. Go to tyt.com slash John to sign up.